Alright guys, it's time to explore Chiang Mai. It's so warm in here, it's like summer. It's crazy. It's amazing. Day one is we're just gonna stay downtown. Tomorrow, I don't know what that is tomorrow. We're going to eat now at the Green Tiger House, which is a vegetarian vegan restaurant actually. It's right next to our Airbnb, so... Yeah, and it looks super nice. It's so nice, here. Okay, so this is a vegetarian slash vegan restaurant. The mango and passion fruit. <laughs> I got fried noodles with vegetables and a mango and passion fruit smoothie. This place is beautiful. It's so peaceful. It makes you really calm down. I don't know, it's, it's just so grounding. I love it. So I got Pad Thai. What better food to start my trip in Thailand than a nice plate of Pad Thai? It's vegetarian though, but it's okay. And a smoothie, mango smoothie. Here we have our amazing smoothies and I ordered some fried noodles with vegetables and I ordered some pad thai. And this is my first bite. First food in Thailand. Oh my God, I want to try your food too. This is all vegetarian guys, by the way. How is it? How's the flavor? <laughs> is it good? I'm so happy. Oh. I feel like I'm in heaven right now, guys. This is so flavorful. You can taste the soy sauce and all the nice vegetables blending together. Here's my first pad thai in Thailand. Oh my gosh. I can see it's glistening in goodness. Mm. I'm not coming back to Canada. Canada flavor is a lie. Don't listen. This is it. This is the real thing. How's your food? Five is in heaven, y'all. Don't even talk to him right now. It's the best. The best. Just the best. Period. Period. Guys, we literally cleaned the plates. Really? It was so good. I feel so full. I'm so happy. <laughs> Zen. Hi guys, so now we are at a different temple now. So it's crazy because the location we're at, we're in the inner circle, downtown Chiang Mai. There's literally temples everywhere you walk. They're so stunning. Yeah, you, so stunning. you turn one corner and bam, there's a temple. This is pretty though. Crazy how these statues look like they're staring at me. So just by chance we found this uh, amazing temple and there's not too many information about it in the internet. It's absolutely stunning and uh, it's so beautiful. It's really breathtaking. All the details, all the statues, it's, it's just so beautiful. It's so quiet. It's like serenity is made from this place. I'm like in a different world. I feel like I'm, I'm so mesmerized. I can't believe it. What do you think, Fabio? This is incredible, guys. We're in the middle of the old town and all you see is this peaceful area. You can hear the birds singing. It's just so beautiful, so peaceful. And a few steps away from the temples, it's starting to get noisy again. Yeah. It's crazy. It's when you're right there, you he you don't hear anything at all. And then as soon as you get out, streets, cars, everything. And I wouldn't be surprised there's another temple we're gonna stumble upon on the way there because there's just a lot of them here.
Hey guys, we're at the Three Kings Monument right now and I don't have any information. I don't know. Let's ask Fabio. Let's go! <laughs> According to the legend, guys, these three kings work together to lay out the city of Chiang Mai. Alright, on to the next one. I survived another day in Chiang Mai. <laughs> Okay, so that's it. This, I don't know, where are we? This place, this is so magical, guys. Like, I keep getting emotional every time we walk into some temple or even just in the streets. It's just so magical. The energy of this whole place. You can feel it, right? You it's can like feel it. The atmosphere is different. I don't know why it is. Maybe it's, it's hard to explain. I got teary eyed, emotional, a lot of emotion. So here, as a sign of respect, we need to leave the shoes outside of the temple. inside a temple right now and where only men are allowed because they believe that um, it sounds so wrong but that's why it's written outside don't so don't hate on me but women are, are not allowed inside because they menstruate and that shows like it's like it's not clean into the eyes of this belief whatever and this is where the pillar of the city of Chiang Mai is buried under the ground Guys, I think we officially, officially, officially fell in love with traveling. Absolutely. <laughs> this is the reclining Buddha that I really wanted to see. And um, it makes I, you feel some type of way, right? Like it does. It's like emotional or something. I don't know. I'm just very talking. It, it, you just can't help it. You tap into something deeper than just like, you know, going on vacation and all mm. that. It's, it's really like a deep journey within. Mm -hmm. and it's so beautiful guys if you get a chance definitely visit Chiang Mai it's totally worth it it's only our second day of travel today and we feel so overwhelmed my head is hurting because yeah. I feel like I'm thinking so much I'm just so into everything mm -hmm. and it's just beautiful today is just literally a temple tour type of day we didn't expect I didn't know that it was going to be a lot of temple Fabio created today's itinerary and the rest of the itinerary so each temple offers different type of vibe if you know what I mean I don't know I hope our vlog or pictures can do justice of how beautiful this place are it's probably not but it's so pretty guys trust me if you guys want to come to Chiang Mai please come we will welcome you we will welcome you because we'll stay here I feel like we want to stay here now we, we're gonna end we're gonna stay here until December 2020. <laughs> We're not gonna go to the other countries. We fell in love with Chiang Mai. So far, Chiang Mai is my favorite. Wow, day two. <laughs> day two. Already, already Can you love. believe it? It's only the day two of our world tour. And wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now to get to the gold temple, we're walking in the back alleys of Chiang Mai, which is very interesting. It's different than the main roads. What do you mean like gold temple? Because literally everywhere we went is gold temple. <laughs> this is <laughs> more gold. One thing I need to remember in Thailand is I need to look right first because the incoming traffic is coming from the right. When you yeah. want to cross, I almost got run over by a car earlier when I didn't look right. We were thinking to rent a motorcycle tomorrow, but yes. honestly, I have the feeling that it's gonna be so tough because I would wanna automatically I would wanna drive the other way. 
So yeah. I'm gonna be worried about that. Because we both can drive motorcycles and we were so confident that like, we were like, oh, we should get a motorcycle tomorrow. But we thought, I thought about it earlier and I'm like, they're actually driving in a different side of the road. So we don't <laughs> want to get into an accident. Yeah. And our insurance will probably say like, oh, that's a dangerous activity. So you should not be doing that. <laughs> You're not covered. We're trying to be secure here. Our destination is to the left. Okay. I was really looking forward for this one, but there's some construction going on so it's fully covered and it's a gold temple so the beauty of it is the outside fully gold and unfortunately it's covered I'm very sad hopefully they'll open it within the next five days but I doubt it well you kind of see it the gold <laughs> just picture it with the gold so positive all these temples did good positivity we're about to give up but then we said oh let's just do a quick walk around and guess what Gold temple is here. Not like the other temples, we're not gold. <laughs> Fabio, man. Actually, do you think the real gold? Maybe some you know of what? it is real gold. You know what? Actually, the ve the real gold, gold one is behind us. If you're planning to come to visit the gold temple, make sure you wear sunglasses because the reflection is insane. <laughs> Lesson of the day, if you see one of the temples covered because of construction, you still go in, still peek through because what you discover may be a huge golden treasure. Yes. Is it actually a treasure? Why not? <laughs> so now we are gonna look for a place where we can grab drinks and just chill and refreshments because it's hot! <laughs> it hot. is very hot. It's hot! And it's only our second day of this world tour. And we'll be doing the and most we'll already. Doing so much. We're jet lagged, sweaty. Three tired. hours sleep. We're <laughs> running three hours sleep. And we'll be doing the most. Ooh. Let's go grab drinks. Hey guys, today's video is gonna be a night market shopping, eating, exploring type vlog. 